All right, again, welcome everyone. Appreciate everyone joining us. We're gonna do an in-depth training on the compensation plan. Again, this will be recorded and post-production, we will break this down into several videos. Uh, but I'm excited about this particular training because although network marketing is about building relationships, uh, in our case, helping people save on uh, products they're probably spending too much on, um, it's also about money because without money, we can't buy back our time. And without our time, we really can't have that dream of uh, financial freedom that we're uh, all looking for. So compensation plan, although it's not everything, uh, really having a great compensation plan is a huge part of uh, success. And more importantly, the compensation plan, but the qualifications within the compensation plan to reach some of the higher ranks or to reach deeper into the pay plan. And I think what we've created here uh, really goes to show how much uh, experience and, and how much wisdom went into this comp plan when we were all putting this together. Uh, because really all of the hoops and the gotchas and all of the qualifications that make no sense and really hinder people's progress are removed from this plan. And what we've added are uh, qualifications to enhance people's, uh, the positive behavior that helps create stability in an organization. Um, and uh, there's just so many great parts of this as, as we go through that. If you have experience in networking, you're going to really appreciate what we've left out and what we've added uh, to the comp plan. And if you have no experience in networking, this is your first time. I'm a little bit jealous, but <laughs> congratulations on uh, finding uh, Accelerate because this is one of the highest paying out, if not the highest paying comp plans in the entire industry. And literally, if someone goes through this video and says that their comp plan pays out more, it's not really a contest, but I wouldn't have them do your taxes because they're not very good at math. Um, so let's get into this really quickly. So we're going to talk a little bit about the five parts, the five ways to earn. And we're also going to talk about the, uh, the placement, how it's structured, and talk a little bit about the uh, compression that we have that is kind of unique. So this is a three by 10 forced matrix. There's all kinds of different uh, types of compensation plans out there. They're binaries, they're um, unilevels, they're hybrids, multiple, you know, multiple legs, two legs, um, and they all have their pluses and their minuses. We chose the three by 10 matrix for a few reasons. Number one, uh, the number of uh, members or uh, subscriptions that we can have in one matrix. Uh, also, the uh, the forced structure of it. So there is no uh, really strategy. There's no experience needed in order to strategize and maximize the matrix because it's done for you. A forced matrix just means that whoever comes in after you, they fall into the next available position. There's no strategy. Somebody didn't come in that has a million dollar experience in 30 years seasoned in this industry, or somebody can come in that's brand new, never heard of it. Uh, they still get placed in the same position. Wherever the next available position, they get placed. And we'll, we'll go a little bit deeper dive into this. But three by 10 does doesn't sound like a huge deal. You know, number three, the number 10, not a big deal, uh, you would think. But let me show you the power of a three by 10 matrix. In a three by 10 matrix, you can fit 88,612 members in that three by 10 little matrix. So when you look at that, that's 88,612 subscriptions. That's 88,612 potential orders, uh, member orders. That's 88,612 potential retail orders. Um, that is a lot of commissionable uh, volume within 88,612 members. But what if you only did half of that? 44,000, half of that, half of that, half of that. Uh, literally, this compensation plan can get you to wherever you want. And the matrix itself is only one of five parts of this whole comp plan. And so if you look at this structure of three by 10, what is it? Well, it just means we're, we have a fixed width and a fixed depth where binaries, for example, are too wide. Um, they're limited to two, uh, unlimited depth, uh, unilevels, unlimited width, limited depth. Uh, a matrix is a fixed width and a fixed depth, but there, there's some caveats here. So we are always restricted to the width in our, in our uh, structure. So we'll never be able to go more than three wide on our front level. But as far as depth goes, 
10 is kind of, it's not a, a solid number because these four bonuses in the compensation plan pay out infinite. You can start paying out infinite depth because they follow the uh, generations or the sponsor tree where the matrix follows the matrix tree or the placement tree. And we'll explain a little bit about that. So generations, these are two important terms that everyone needs to understand. Uh, sometimes you use them interchangeably, um, but they really are very, very different. Generations, just like genealogy between, we'll just say a child, a parent, grandparent, or great grandparent. So genealogy or generations, it basically means who sponsored who. It has nothing to do with where they are in your matrix. It could be one first level, it could be 1,000 levels, it doesn't matter. Generations are always the same. They follow who sponsored who. So if you think about it that way, that's the sponsor tree. That's generations. The, the levels are just like the building, in, uh, the, the levels of floors in a building, meaning it's where they're placed, right? It's physically, where are they physically located within the matrix? And so generations and physical location and levels two different things, but when you look at, when you look at, oh, this is an example here. So if you sponsored uh, Michael, Tara, Jordan, and Steve, then Michael, Tara, and Jordan would be your first generation because you personally sponsored them, right? It's like the, the, uh, the child and the parent. You sponsored them, first generation. And they'd also be on your first level because they're physically on your first level. Now, Steve, he was also personally sponsored by you. You sponsored all four of them. So he is also your first generation. But because you're limited to three wide, he was placed on your second level. So Steve would be first generation, second level. Does that make sense? One's a physical location, and one is the relationship with the parent um, uh, genealogy. So once you understand that, uh, it's easy to understand why these four um, follow the genealogy, which means they can literally be placed anywhere in your matrix. And we did this for a couple really key and important reasons. A lot of the times in compensation plans, they're built so that you have to keep volume and personally sponsored up high, or else you have that fear of loss and you can start losing commissions. And so every time in unilevels, for example, there are some unilevels that you know, go four, five, six, seven, eight, 10, 20 wide. There are some unilevels that every time you sponsor a new person, it starts an entire new leg. Um, and then there's unilevels where you can place people wherever you want spread throughout. But here, you literally could have a member that you personally sponsor um, and they could be placed because this is a, a, a forced matrix. They're placed wherever the next available position is. Let's say a couple of years into this business and uh, your matrix is full and you're, you're going way beyond your 10th level. What happens if a personally sponsored now falls naturally on your 15th level? Are you going to lose anything? Absolutely not, because it does not matter if they're placed in your first level or, uh, or your 15th level, right? This is contrary to everything that we know mostly in, um, in compensation plans, so it's a little bit uh, scary to think about depth. But if it follows genealogy, meaning who sponsored who, the relationship between them, the levels don't matter. The only time levels matter is when we talk about the matrix. And even the matrix itself, that 10 number in the 3 by 10, is not set either. And let me show you a little bit about compression and dynamic compression. Now, these are things, you guys, you don't need to write any of this down. You don't have to remember all of this. If you see a few highlights and you happen to have a pen and paper, go ahead and jot them down or you know take notes or whatever. But this is recorded. You can come back at this. I talk a little bit fast. You can uh, kind of uh, go back in the recording slide by slide and, and really get an understanding of this. Uh, explaining compression and, and dynamic compression is not really necessary, but I really do want you to understand understand what's, what kind of significance it makes um, having dynamic compression in your uh, compensation plan. So a lot of companies out there will start talking about when you say we have dynamic compression, they say we do too. But what they're actually talking about is they have compression, regular compression. And dynamic compression and compression are very different. We have compression and we also have dynamic compression. As a matter of fact, literally everybody in the industry uh, has compression. And compression just means that if in the matrix, there are people that are, in our case, are not active. 
meaning their subscriptions are relapsed or they haven't renewed their subscription and they become inactive. If it's for one second, one day, one month, wherever, whatever amount of time they're inactive, if any commissions get generated in that one second that they're inactive, um, they are automatically pulled out of the matrix temporarily. You don't lose your position and physically you're still there, but the, the software sees you as not there. They skip you and then everything is compressed. So everyone moves over, um, everyone moves up. So there are no empty positions there are no inactive positions available. Um, so everything is a solid matrix again, that's regular compression. And then let's say, you know, 10 minutes later, three days, a month later, you decide to upgrade your subscription, then you automatically get placed back into it. And the next commission that's generated, the software will recognize you as active and you'll be included in the, uh, in the, the commission's uh, formula, the calculations. So that's regular compression. Most people already have that in the compensation plan. Dynamic compression is a little bit different piece. A little bit more complex to understand, um, but once you understand it, you'll you'll appreciate the significance. So just think, just know that our comp plan pays from the bottom up, right? It may not seem that way when you're looking at levels one, two, three, four, five, but it literally pays from the bottom up. And so, why is that significant? Well, what the what the software does is it looks for qualifying um, members. And so when it pays out a commission, and we're going to say on level 13, and we're going to be specifically looking at, say, number one up here. But one, normally, if you just look at a three by 10 matrix, you just think, okay, well, that's, that's the cutoff line right there. I don't get paid on anything below that. But here's what dynamic compression does. Because the only qualification we have is the number of affiliates that you personally sponsor, the number of members that you personally enroll. That's the only qualification. We have no OV, GV, CV, no leg balancing. We have no volume flushing. We have none of that, right? You don't have to worry about any of that strategy, any of that nonsense that stops people from reaching the next levels. The only thing that we have as a qualifier is how many people did you personally sponsor? So it starts with zero, and then once you get to three, you hit director. Once you get to 10, you hit senior director, et cetera, and so forth. So the software looks at who is who, what rank are you, and what do you qualify for at that rank, starting from the very bottom. So it looks at the very last, uh, in this case, we're at the $20, so we're looking at uh, subscription renewals in the matrix. So they renewed their subscription, right? And so it's going to look, and it's going to say, okay, well, who gets, who qualifies for level one, moving up, right? And so... Who qualifies? Well, everyone qualifies in our comp plan for level one. As a matter of fact, everyone qualifies for seven levels in the compensation plan. And we'll talk about how much that means. That means without sponsoring, you coming in and being an affiliate, you automatically qualify for seven levels. So the software is going to say, okay, what is the seven levels up? Let's pay out those commissions. But we always pay out 10 levels, right? Um, with dynamic compression, there's very little breakage. If you just have regular compression, if someone does not qualify for a commission, it goes back to the company. And that's where a company makes a lot of money is through breakage. So although some companies will say they pay 80% like us, the entire industry averages is like 35, 37% when it comes right down to it. And so our 80% is really, we pay over 80% uh, on average on all of our commissions. Some cases, uh, specifically, if you look at what the matrix and the mentoring bonus, which we'll talk about pay, that's 90%. If you do the math, you look at what the $20 pays on your renewal, the matrix pays out 50%, the match pays out 80%. If you combine those two together, um, not the 80 and the 50, but what the 50 pays out and 80% of that 50, that's 90%. $18 of every 20 goes back to the field. Okay, that's huge. No other company can do this. Um, and, and I guarantee that, that when you compare apples to apples, well, this is one of the uh, highest paying out, if not the highest paying out comp plan that exists. Um, so anyway, so it looks at number seven. We still have eight, nine, and 10 to pay out. So what it's going to do, it's going to look at a director. Is, there, uh, is number five a director? Well, we labeled here who's what, and number five is obviously not a director. So they don't qualify for level eight. Um, so that member gets skipped and they look at uh, the next level, the next member. And they say, okay, do you qualify for level eight? Well, anyone director above qualifies for level eight. So yes, that member gets paid. 
And then it says, do you qualify for level nine? Well, you have to be an executive director or above to qualify for level nine. So it looks and it says, no, you're a senior director. Number two, are you an executive director? No, you're a senior director, executive director number one. Are you an executive director? Yes. So we paid out nine levels. Well, we still have a 10th level to pay out. So what the software is going to do is going to continually go up the, uh, gene up the genealogy or up the levels and they're gonna find the next available ambassador and they're gonna pay out that last 10th commission. Now, breakage comes in this compensation plan. If there are no ambassadors, that commission will go back to the company. Uh, but other than that, it will find the next ambassador and it will pay out that commission. And so what happens is because ambassadors, you need 100 personally sponsored, which is not an easy task. Um, there may be no ambassadors for 40 levels, 30 levels, 50 levels. So that ambassador literally just got paid dozens and dozens of levels beyond his uh, 10, uh, three by 10 structure. Does that make sense? Dynamic compression does not just skip somebody and pay and then it's done and it pays it back to the company. It will keep going until it literally runs out of levels and hits the company. And, the, and then at that point, it's paid back to the company. And that's literally the only breakage in this compensation plan. It helps us actually feed the rest of the compensation plan with what little breakage that we do get. Very, very minimal. Um, and so that's how dynamic compression works. And that's how in the matrix, you can literally go down dozens and dozens and dozens of levels and still get paid. And this is another reason why it's important to always be uh, introducing people, inviting people and building your business because the higher ranks you are, um, the deeper you're going to get paid down into the matrix because other people will not be paid uh, that are say director and you're a senior director or executive director, you're going to get paid more often than they do because you're a higher rank as far as reaching below your 10th levels. You just think about anything that you get below your 10 levels is just extra, it's gravy, it's um, just something extra that we put in the comp plan so that there wasn't any breakage or very little going to the company. You know, we want to build a company that's healthy, not wealthy. We're not interested in making accelerate the, you know, the, the giant 50,000 square foot uh, building and, you know, million dollar events and things like that. It's no interest. I'd rather put it back into the compensation plan, watch everyone uh, thrive and become financially free. And then we'll, uh, we'll leave all that other stuff to everyone else. So how is the three by 10 matrix filled? Well, this is a good, this is another great feature I love about this. So you would think because we're limited to our first three uh, or, or three on our first um, uh, level that if you sponsored four by six, where would they go? You would think they would go probably right here, right? The next three available positions. But the problem with structuring something that way, uh, and trust me, we, we started this way a year and a half ago. Um, and what we found out is that only one person uh, ends up, or two people, you and one person ends up with the majority of the benefit. The other two and three in this example, uh, they're left with nothing. And so not that we should rely on spill, not that you should be pitching spill as a prospecting tool to get people in. If you get spill, um, that is great, so, meaning members and volume coming from above. If you get it, that is great. You don't count on it. You don't pitch it that way. That's not a, we're not a get rich quick scheme. We want realistic expectations for everyone. But what we ended up doing is we did what they call a waterfall effect, where you'd have one, uh, number four would go in the first left position. Uh, number five would go into the second left position. Number six would go into the third left position. And then number seven would go in the middle, number eight in the middle, number nine in the middle, number 10 on the right, number, uh, on the outside leg, number 11 on the outside leg, number 12 on the outside leg. We did this to spread the love, spread the wealth, right? Instead of one person getting three uh, people from above, you end up getting one spreading out between uh, multiple, multiple people. So uh, this works much better and it puts money into people's pockets a, last, a lot quicker. So this particular uh, representation, this example shows that you're doing all the work. 
right? There's no leverage here. There's no teamwork here. You just sponsored 12 people on your own. No one else is doing anything. So let's just be realistic about what the comp compensation plan really does, because what you're looking at right here in your organization or what you look like, what you look at in your genealogy, as far as your physical view, all you see is one part. You see your part of the matrix. But the reality is you are part of a bigger matrix, which is a part of a bigger matrix than that. So for example, if you zoomed out a little bit from your matrix, you would see that where you thought that you were the top of your matrix, you may be one of three of someone's front leg. And those three that you had on your front level may be three of nine on someone's second leg leg or three of 27 on someone's third leg. Do you, you understand? So it's it's a bigger, bigger structure than what uh, what we see as a uh, as physical uh, genealogy in our back office. So what it would really look like or could look like or has looked like in the past, uh, we just had some new members come in uh, recently that uh, just were on fire and they ended up spend, uh, sponsoring 20, 30, 40 plus people in just a matter of uh, a week or two. Um, and so this really does happen. It happens quite often in this uh, compensation plan. So what will really happen is when you go and you look, okay, well, I have my fourth person. Where's my number four going to go? They're about to sign up. I uh, don't need to strategize. They're going to go in the next available position. You look in your genealogy and you see this open position because this is all you can see right here. And you're like, okay, when this guy signs up, he's just about to, he just became a free member. He's going to upgrade. He's going to go right here, right? Because that's what the software does. But in the meantime, what happened was this guy that's above you could be your sponsor, might not be your sponsor in the matrix. It doesn't matter. You're put in the same, in whatever position became available first for you. So your place there, the guy above you will just say, is going to sponsor his 22nd person. And so what's going to end up happening is the software is going to look and it's going to say, okay, can this guy put number 22 here? No, that's full. Can you put number 22 here? No, that's full. Can you put 22 here? No, that's full. Right here is empty. So we are going to place him there. And then what happens is number two comes in, he sponsors three, number one sponsors one, you know, none of this is really important. I'm just trying to show you that what, when four, five, four finally um, joins, it could be a matter of seconds, minutes, hours, um, he's gonna be placed in this position because this is the next outside or inside leg that's available. And then if this member here above or any member really sponsors anyone else, it's gonna fall into this position right here because it goes left, middle, right, left, middle, right. And then the next person will fall here. And then because this position's uh, full, the next person will fall here, et cetera, and so forth. So you can see now when you're looking at something like this, it's not just you sponsoring 12 members. It's not just um, you sponsoring three members. 6,561 looks really daunting if it's you um, building a single team of 6,561. But when you see that you are bigger picture, you're a bigger part of a larger matrix um, in leverage, then you can see it can happen really, really quickly, especially in the structure and the dollar amount that um, our company uh, requires twenty dollars. I mean, that's really a no-brainer for most people. So let's get into some of the specifics on the different five parts of the comp plan. So the first part we're going to talk about is the retail bonus. Now we now this is another one of the enhancements we went through a couple. I forgot to mention them uh, from before, but uh, what we had before and what we have now are, are kind of irrelevant. But this is just one of the newer ones that we um, enhanced. This used to be uh, eighty percent payout. Uh, in the retail, we've moved it to 100% payout. And so what this basically means is the retail bonus, it's paid out on the difference between the retail and the wholesale price, okay? So if we have a $40 product on the front end of a Shop Accelerate, uh, 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 customer facing, and it's $40 retail, and then it member pricing on the back office, uh, affiliate facing is $20 member price, the difference between 20 and 40 is 20. We pay out 100% of that um, back into the field. 
And so we just gave an extra 20% from what it was just a couple of weeks ago. And so in this case, if you look at 60% uh, here, 15, 10, five, a hundred percent is paid out 60% to the, uh, to the person that initiated the sale. So you, you give out your link, somebody goes to your website, they go through, they want the focus product as an example, the collagen, uh, the modifier product, you're gonna make 60% of the difference between retail and wholesale. So in this example, you're gonna get paid $12, right? Which is 60% uh, of 20. Then you'll be paid 15% on anyone in your organization that you've sponsored who also retails 10%, et cetera, all the way down to 1%. So literally 100% is paid out in the retail bonus. So especially if you bring in people that have um, large uh, websites or if they do uh, any affiliate type of marketing, large email lists, we get a new product that come out, they blast their email list with, hey, we just got a new sugar to fiber product called Modifiber, um, reduces up to 90% of your sugar calories. Uh, you know, fewer calories means a skinnier you, you know, that type of thing. People go to the website, they purchase the Modifiber. Well, every sale, every retail sale, 10 affiliates are paid, right, in a, in a three by 10 matrix. So 10 commissions are generated from every retail sale. Uh, so that can add up pretty quickly. Uh, our fast start bonus, we pay up to 80% on the fast start bonus. Um, this is the initial subscription when someone joins. So when an affiliate or when a, uh, a customer member pays the 10 or the $20, this generates automatically a uh, 10 generation fast start. And so using the affiliate $20 as an example, when someone initially comes in and they upgrade from a free member to affiliate, 10 generation of fast start, 80% is generated. So if you look at 50% of 20 is 10, 10% 10 of 20 is, is two, 5% one, et cetera. Um, this generates 10 commissions, 10 different affiliates get paid um, depending on what your rank is. But now this is a new uh, enhancement that we made now with a fast start, all means everyone you don't have to sponsor anyone before you got paid down one generation. Um, now you get paid down two generations uh, without having to sponsor anyone. And we did this because uh, we have had several occasions where someone joins, they sponsor one person and before they could even sponsor a second or third person to become director, that person ends up generating um, uh, other fast starts that you missed that 10% on because you weren't a director yet. You were like in limbo between one and three. Um, and so, which is not fair. And so if you did the work, we wanna pay you that. So immediately you get paid on two levels now instead of one. So, I mean, that's, that's a lot of money being paid out in a $20 fast start. So the company makes very little, again, enough to be healthy, enough to create a little war chest in case something happens, enough to, you know, buy uh, and generate new product and, um, and whatnot. But uh, really the whole point of this comp plan is to get you guys into a position where you start buying back some of your life. It's not about the company making a ton of money. Company doesn't have family. A company doesn't have all these goals and, and dreams that we do. So um, we're taking this money and putting it back into the field. The wholesale bonus. And we pay on all retail bonuses, uh, uh, retail sales, but we also pay on all wholesale bonuses. Now, this is another enhancement recently. We had a flat um, $1 uh, bonus for the sponsor and 90 cents, I believe, for the other nine uh, levels. And so it paid out $1.90 in wholesale bonus. Uh, we've upgraded that recently to a flat 15%, which means 10% gets paid to the sponsor and another 5% is split down nine levels. It makes it a little awkward when it comes to the math because you're at 0.55%. It doesn't seem like a whole lot, but what we paid before was a dollar and then um, I think it was 90, a dollar 90 total. That's what it was. It was a dollar and then 10 cents on the next uh, nine levels. It, it totaled a dollar 90. Um, here, if you look, um, it's like 450. Um, now. So you, it enhanced it quite a bit at 30 and then 16 cents. It's actually a little bit more than 15 for you math geeks out there. Yes, I know it's more than 15. Yes, I know if you took, uh, you know, uh, uh, what, 5% and divided by nine, it's 
point one six 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 seven. Yeah, that's what the that's what it actually calculates. I'm doing this for um, you know for sharing purposes, so it fits on one slide. Um, but four dollars and fifty cents. That's actually a little bit more than fifteen percent gets paid out uh, in all member orders. Um, all. Um, customer orders that are members as well it pays out 15% to everyone. Um, so again, the, we want to put as much into the comp plan as humanly possible and the 15% on all wholesale members. So if you have sponsor a lot of members and they purchase product, they're getting it 30, 50, 70% off of retail anyway, and you're still making a commission off of that. We have no requirements and we'll talk about that. We have no requirements to purchase product at all. Yet we, we sell uh, uh, tons of products to members uh, whether they're customer members or affiliate members because they can save so much money and our products are high quality and uh, they work. So people are purchasing products over and over and over again voluntarily. It's not requirement in order to uh, take part in the compensation plan. It's not a pay to play um, type of gimmick that you need this much in auto ship and 100 PV and, and volume and you need to buy this founders pack to reach this level. And, and all, all that nonsense you can just remove um, from the vocabulary with this, uh, with this structure. So this is the wholesale bonus. All of this is pretty self-explanatory if you look at the, uh, look at the comp plan, but it's, it's nice to have it explained uh, to some degree. So this is the matrix bonus. This is where your residual income, and this is the only bonus that's paid uh, through the levels where your three by 10 comes uh, into, uh, into play to some degree. So this is a really easy one to figure out because it's 5% for every level. 5% down 10 levels. Again, when someone comes in, their subscription is a fast start bonus. Every fast start bonus generates 10 commissions, right? 10 levels. When somebody renews, it becomes a matrix bonus. So the next month, again, 10 uh, commissions are generated through the renewal of the subscription. So if you look at that, it's 5%, 5% 20 is $1, very easy to do the math. So if you have 88,000, I think that number is wrong at the bottom now that I'm looking at it. If you have 88,000 plus um, uh, positions, subscriptions within your matrix and each one of them can generate a dollar, what does that mean in dollars? Uh, again, I'm not saying going to make all this money. I'm just using this as an example. Uh, you can make it. We structured it so you can do this. But really, I mean, whether it's a $20 deal like this or a $2,000 deal, uh, you know, a lot of people just, they don't get out of their own way, unfortunately. Um, they don't like rejection. They have um, you know, little issues with uh, speaking with people or comfortable with confidence, that type of thing. So this $1 in this structure right here is very, very simple to calculate. So 88,000 plus $1 each. Um, if you did 44,000, 22,000, 11,000 members, it's 11,000. It's very easy to calculate this. Um, and when you take this commission at 5% and $20 a subscription, compare it to say a $10 uh, membership at another company and 2.5% paid in, in, the, uh, in the matrix, we literally pay out four times the amount of residual income with this compensation plan in the matrix than somebody that pays out 2.5%. We literally, the difference between 10 and $20 makes it four times harder. You need four times the number of members in, in something that pays $10 at 2.5 than you do at our comp plan that pays out 20 on, uh, on 5%. So it's four times the amount of pay and four times the um, number of members on their end to make the equivalent uh, compensation that our comp plan uh, pays out. So that's pretty simple. 5% uh, on the 20 is a dollar and just multiply that by the number of members. Now, the great thing about this, remember matrix is not generation. Doesn't matter who sponsored who. Most of the people within your matrix, you're never going to know, you're never going to meet, you have no idea who they are. They're just coming in from free members upgrading, they fall into the matrix. Somebody above you sponsoring, they fall into the matrix. Somebody else above them sponsoring, it falls into the matrix. People below you sponsoring, it falls into the matrix. Everything that you do falls into the matrix. And so as the matrix fills, as your team grows, um, we had a team here just do like 100 plus members in a matter of just a few days. Um, building their organization. So what if they did those 100 members, 10% of them did something 
close to that, a fraction of it, 10% of that, uh, you can grow a team very, very quickly, again, without having to do all of the work yourself. It's about teamwork. It's about leverage. That's what network marketing is all about. It's using other people's efforts in conjunction with your own efforts, right? Building something <clears throat> together. The, mate, uh, the mentoring bonus. This is exciting because what you'll find in a lot of the compensation plans out there is you'll find that you're afraid to reach down deep and help members that need your help because you're not getting paid, right? Here, it's worth investing your time in people that are first generation, second, third, fourth, fifth, 100th level, 300, 3,000 levels deep. It's worth investing your time because you get a return on your investment with the mentoring bonus. And this is exactly like it says, it's a mentoring bonus. And so for this example here, I think I have, uh, if you're affiliate, if you help them, if you mentor them and you help them build their, uh, their uh, matrix check here to $1,000, you're helping with three-way calls, you're showing them how to um, get on the uh, Facebook uh, private group for um, corporate member or for the corporate Facebook group, you're showing them how to uh, do graphics or, you know, get the graphics from your back office resource center and post them, um, how to do follow up. If you're, if you're doing what you're supposed to do in your job, um, whatever you help them create in uh, income from their matrix, you are going to earn in the mentoring bonus 50%. So in this case, if you help them generate $1,000 in matrix uh, bonus pay, you're going to get 500. If you have 10 people, 30, 40, um, a gentleman, uh, Jacob, that came in, 40, I don't even know how many people he has now, but you multiply that. If you help all of those members make $1,000 and you have 40 members that you help and you get 50% of that, that's 20 grand or that's 40, yeah, that's 20,000 just in the mentoring bonus, 50%. And so when I said it pays out 90% earlier, Look, if you if you do the math, if somebody does the math, if you look at the matrix bonus that pays out uh, fifty percent, right? So we'll just say at twenty dollars, it's going to pay out ten total, one dollar times uh, down ten levels. So there's ten dollars, um, twenty dollars to be a member, ten gets paid out in the matrix. Then eighty percent of the mentoring bonus. How much is eighty percent of ten? That's eight dollars, right? So that's eighteen dollars. Are getting paid in just the uh, in just the matrix and the mentoring bonus, ninety percent. So that means that we literally you get paid fifteen times on one commission that's generated. It generates fifteen different commissions for uh, other people. The mentoring bonus and the matrix bonus all attached to the matrix bonus. So every thousand um, dollars, you're going to have eighty percent of that generated in mentoring bonuses as well. So this is the point of this bonus is to feel comfortable reaching down deep. You should be doing it anyway, but I understand you. You know, some people don't want to you know spend a lot of time with people that need help if they really could be spending a lot of time with people that need help and they're you know financially gaining from it. Um, so what we ended up doing with this mentoring bonus, you can reach down all the way to your personals. You can wherever they lay, you know, whatever they, they land, you can reach down to their personals and their personals, personals and their personal, personal, personals, because you're going to make between three and 50 percent of whatever you help them make in the matrix. That to me is super, super exciting. Um, because in order to form a strong team, I just heard this today in a podcast, nothing to do with network marketing, but if you put it into network marketing terms and accelerate, um, you know, there are takers and there are givers and there are matchers, right? And so really to have a strong team, you need a strong team of givers, right? People that that um, are, they want it as much for someone else as they want it for themselves, right? They're willing to, to sacrifice a little to give somebody, um, you know, a little bit of a boost here, a boost there to help them because that's that's more satisfying than what they are sacrificing as far as time or, or money. And so uh, really to create a strong team, you really need to find a bunch of givers. And with this mentoring bonus, this encourages that behavior, right? It's not, it's not having people shrink with fear of loss. It's saying, fine, if I reach down, if that guy, if the person that I sponsored isn't helping his personally sponsored get a massive matrix check because he's MIA or he's going to do 15 different other streams of incomes. I mean, you know, then I'm going to reach down because I'm going to earn 10% on whatever 
that person sponsors, or if that person, that person, that person, I'm going to earn 5%. And so it really incentivizes you to help somebody build the biggest matrix check that they possibly can. And so that is the mentoring bonus. Now, the rank requirements, I kind of went over them a little bit already. Pretty simple, but a, a director is three retail sales or three members that you personally sponsor. Senior director moves up to 10. Executive director moves up to 20. Uh, corporate director to 50. And ambassador, 100. Again, these are all things that you need to make sure when you're sponsoring people, they have realistic expectations. This is not something you're not going to sponsor 100 people in two weeks, all right? So it's just something that you're gonna build up to over the course of time. So make sure when you're sponsoring people, when you're training people, when you're getting them in their first few days, you're not giving them unrealistic expectations or hyping things up because you see that 88,000 some odd uh, uh, potential in the matrix. Really be realistic. This is something that's gonna be built over time. This is something with legs. Um, you know, Every time someone says, oh, Dan did this, Dan built this. You know, Look, a year and a half ago, I bought a little piece of high ground, right? And then I invited a few people and now all of you have joined and you're helping me together build this fortress, this impenetrable fortress that we all are gonna be able to benefit from. We don't have to have the rug pulled out from under us ever again. We don't have to go start a whole new thing again because this company did that or this company did that, right? This company is going to be built so that it lasts forever. And um, this is really what, what this is all about, is really creating the last stop for most of us that are, uh, have been disappointed with everything in the past. Have we had our problems? Absolutely. Have we had our glitches and software issues and shipping things over the course of a year and a half growing? Uh, yeah, absolutely. But you know, that is to be expected uh, with any company uh, that, is, um, that has any type of potential. And so here we are a year and a half later, uh, still a debt-free company. Uh, we have our, our debt is like minuscule, uh, maybe twenty, thirty thousand dollars in between. You know, product ninety-day um, uh, net terms we have with some of them. We have no company owners beside myself. There's no investors. There's no partners. Uh, literally, the decisions that I make as the company owner are decisions that are based off of what you uh, suggest. Right. So a lot of these changes to the comp plan, a lot of the new social media graphics, the brand new uh, revamp of the Go20X website, the landing page. If you looked at it, it's, it's a whole new look since the other day. Um, th these are all things that are generated from uh, insight into the field, because I've been in, on that side of the fence for 30 plus years where you are. I've been a distributor. I've been frustrated. I've watched all of these things happen. And so it gives me a little bit of insight and a little bit of appreciation for the hard work that uh, really goes into uh, acquiring a team and, and, and sharing a brand and acquiring customers. So, so this is the compensation plan. Just a, one more slide here. Why accelerate? These are just one of a thousand reasons why, but it's free to join, only 20 bucks to upgrade. Literally, there's no decision, especially, which I didn't even add this in the in here, but I should have. Uh, we have a 90 day, after 90 day uh, guarantee on uh, affiliate memberships. If you become affiliate, if you're free, you upgrade to a affiliate. You're not happy after 90 days. You actually invited people to your business and you did all of the, the business building behaviors we suggest. Um, and you're still not happy, then we'll give you your 60 bucks back, 20 times three months. Uh, no additional product purchases required. We don't require you to purchase extra product, not wholesale, not retail. $20 subscription is the only product we ask you to purchase uh, every single month as a member. You get all kinds of benefits with that besides taking part in the compensation plan. Um, but 80% total payout, highest in the industry. Um, and again, you find people that come around that say, uh, our payout more, I'd like to see that. Um, they're probably just not very good at math. 80%, uh, no CV, no PV, GV, OV, leg balancing, no volume flushing, no you know three three stars to make one four star. You have none of that stuff in this compensation plan. Uh, there is no gotchas, no hoops. We You had to make some qualifications, which is personally sponsored, just so people don't come in and just sit there, right? We need to encourage people to move, to take action. Um, it's a, a behavior that is necessary, right? For you and for us as a company. 
Um, but there are zero placement or structure strategies needed. Uh, you don't have to have strategies with your upline to figure out at the end of the month where you're missing volume, what kind of, you know, you got to en uh, enroll your dog to fill a spot in order for you to get a check. Um, I've seen it all happen. Uh, we don't have any of that. We don't have to worry about it. Whoever comes in after you is placed in the next available position uh, in the matrix. Um, we pay on all product orders, retail and members orders. You're never going to see any volume. You're not going to see anything that's sold, whether a service or product that doesn't generate a commission. Everything, every part of your blood, sweat, and tears, time that you take away from your family is going to be compensated for in this compensation plan. I can guarantee it. Uh, every dollar, every $20 subscription renewal pays out 90%. And when people come to you and say, oh, that's just impossible, do the math. It's absolutely not impossible. We literally pay out a total of 80% plus on, if you look at the totality of our comp plan, 90% in that particular case of all renewals, that goes right back into the field. The company can survive on very little. We, we don't, again, we're, we're here to be healthy, not wealthy as, as far as a company goes. Um, so we're, we have enough to thrive and to build and, and, and become a solid um, uh, fortress, so to speak. Um, so we don't need a lot. We're not banking on retiring or selling the company or going public. None of that really matters. It's not the whole point of this company. The whole point is to build something that we all can build together and never have to go anywhere else again. Um, and so uh, let's see, potential income of up to $32.79 without sponsoring. This is a great benefit. It's not something I would pitch to everyone um, because, you know, some people will come in and just wait for spill, just wait for, you know, you told me I can make $32.79 without sponsoring anybody. Well, the, it, the potential is here. If you come in, you get paid on all, you can, you have qualified for all seven levels. Anything that comes your way and falls within those seven levels, you're going to get paid on. The total in that, if you $1 per uh, subscriber, is looking at $32.79. So the potential of that amount without any sponsoring, again, I wouldn't pitch it. You don't want those types of people, honestly, in the company. Uh, they'll just, um, you know, they're just a different way of thinking uh, than uh, what a millionaire mindset would uh, would bring you. So 70, I say 50 to 70 percent off on retail and then landing pages, social media graphics, e-commerce. We literally have everything um, that you need to build the, or, or an organization. Do we have everything that we're going to have? No, not yet. We're, we're slowly building over the course of time everything that we're going to have, but literally everything that we have right now allows you not to have to reinvent the wheel. You don't have to create new graphics. You don't have to create new post ideas. You don't have to create a software to manage your downline. We all have all of that in uh, with this $20 a month. We stock the product. We ship the product. We take your customer's money. We eat the merchant fees. We, we take care of regulatory issues in other markets, uh, shipping issues in other markets. We pay, um, we pay uh, you weekly uh, through direct deposit uh, all around the world. We take care of all of that and we pay you commissions for introducing people to our brand and generating sales and new members. And so direct deposit weekly with commissions. So that is the compensation plan in a nutshell, guys. It's, it is a simple compensation plan once you get to understand it. Um, we try to make it as simple with as few hoops as possible. Um, no, this is not you know, $1,500 commissions on founders packs that are in some companies where all the hype and, uh, you know, all that goes, no, you're, we're not going to have those types of commissions with what we have, um, because that's not what this is intended for. We're not a flash in the pan. We're not a hypey company. Uh, we want to slowly build residual income, buy back one hour, two, three, four hours of our time, eventually, you know, replace a part-time income, eventually replace a full-time income. You know, I don't make any promises to anybody, to the people that I do talk to, I always tell them this, I guarantee you, if you listen to what I say, if you're coachable, if you do what I tell you to do in the next 12 to 24 months, I probably can replace the income from your full-time job. That's the realistic expectations that I give people when I talk to them. Um, I don't tell them, hey, in six weeks, you're going to be rich. You know, I don't talk about that. But realistically, do you want to go start over every month for the next tw 24 months? Or do you want to focus, partner up with me, roll up your sleeves as high as I do, and let's work on this, come up with a strategy, and I'll show you how to replace your income in just a short period of time. Maybe, maybe sh a lot shorter than that um, if you are really coachable. And so that is it, guys. I hope everyone can... Uh, uh, can appreciate the compensation plan a little bit more. If you have any questions, I'm going to post uh, 
maybe this uh, slide or a slide in the Facebook private group. If you're not a member in the group, um, get with your sponsor, have them invite you in there. It's an invite only group, uh, but I'm gonna post this. Any questions you have on the comp plan specifically, um, comp plan specifically, um, go ahead and post them underneath this slide uh, or a, a compensation plan slide in the in the Facebook room after the call or after the Zoom, and I'll answer all the questions or have somebody answer all the questions one by one. But um, I think we're going to do another uh, training call next week. Uh, I'll figure out the time. I know we're getting close to Thanksgiving and a lot of travel and prep time, but uh, I'll figure out uh, when uh, and maybe I'll just record it. Uh, but we'll talk about uh, prospecting strategies. So I know we're getting, that's probably the number one thing that we get asked. How do you prospect? Who do you talk to? What tools do you use? How do you duplicate? You know, how do you get people started? Those types of things. So prospecting and getting started the right way will be the next training. And uh, we'll try to schedule that for uh, sometime next week. So thanks everyone. I appreciate it. Have a great uh, rest of Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, opportunity overviews. These are for your guests. Trainings are mainly for uh, members, free members, affiliates. Tuesdays and Thursdays in English, nine o'clock Eastern Standard Time. And then on Wednesday, uh, eight, uh, eight o'clock um, in Spanish. So invite your guests that they speak Spanish on Wednesdays, English, Tuesdays, and Thursdays, nine o'clock Eastern Standard Time, xizoom.com. Thanks, everyone. Have a great rest of the week, and we'll see you on Tuesday.